My name's Joel Gibbard. I'm the founder of the Open Hand Project. At the moment, we're in Mission Control, and uh, this is actually the bedroom where I grew up. And so this is where the development started, and this is where it's been happening for the last few months. So this is the Dextrous Robotic Prosthetic Hand, and it's a low-cost robotic hand made out of 3D printed plastic. And I can close the fingers, and as one becomes impeded, it will stop trying to close. A nice test of this is using an egg, because it's a delicate object and it's also quite a strange shape. I've always been interested by the human hand, so from a robotics perspective, it's a very complex uh, part of the human body. And I found, uh, as a roboticist, I wanted to try and replicate that in a way that gave somebody comparable functionality. So we can demonstrate how this would work on an amputee, because I have the same muscles that an amputee would. They just wouldn't have the hand. So I can connect up the electrodes and then flex my arm like this, and then that can move the hand. None of this would be possible without 3D printing because prototyping in plastic like this would cost a lot. Every single time that you want to get a new part made, you'd have to send off for it, you'd have to wait for it to be delivered, and you'd have to pay a premium for all of that service. With a 3D printer, I could, for instance, come up with an idea, model it on the computer, print it and test it, all within the space of around two hours. It's not really about the money for me, so all I'm trying to do is raise enough money through crowdfunding to complete the project, which should take a year. And by that point, everything will be open source, everything will be online, and people will be able to make these devices themselves, make them and sell them if they want to. Perhaps if I feel that there's a business opportunity at the end of the year, I'll think about trying to make the hands myself and sell them. But for the time being, at least, all I want to do is make the devices more accessible.